Oh really? In Where? Ecuador. 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 Mm -hmm. ah, it's good spot for. Yeah. So babe. Mm. Yeah. What about L's? L's. The equidist. Was it equidist? Equidist letter, letter sequence. sequence. <coughs> well, you could take the Oxford Dictionary and do the same thing if you put it out in the spreadsheet, and you search in anything you want, you'll get an answer. Now, the L's are based on. The Torah, which is a lot of crap, satanic. However, I got a copy of it from Connie in uh, Michigan City, and uh, she was uh, the first North American believer. I met her at a uh, Baha'i chaperone, and uh, <coughs> she sent me the disc, so a uh, part copy. Of it. So I loaded it in, and you try and put Jesus in there, you get nothing. So what I did, uh, I was searching everything on a 10,000 skip. So those of you who have got the program, set it at 10,000 skip. And you've got a Hebrew uh, uh, concordance, which you take any letter in Hebrew, and you can transpose that to an English letter, and vice versa. So you put Jesus in, you get nothing. So what you do is you open up Notepad or one of your uh, Microsoft Works or something like that, and you type in capital letters uh, in bold, uh, Jesus. Then you put that into the search engine, and you hit the search, and it'll come up at the 10,000 skip. It'll come up um, 4,848 which is 484.8 is a hyper pyramid. But then you start searching them out. You go to the, um, uh, where Jesus, for example, you go to the 946 of the skip and see where that is. And when you go there, you find it's got Marshall and Golightly and all sorts of things scattered around. So then you can go to the 555th, which is the Christ. You look at that. Same thing. So that's how the skips work. So thank you, um, Miss Lucifer, for your children. Just in that's Cain. Cain actually, his his wife was Lucifer. Lucifer is a female. Mm. All angels, you see. So um, this is her, the Adam parable. Now parable means martial in Hebrew, Marshall. That's all sorts of neat stuff like that. But you can take any series of words, any, any uh, uh, in the Torah, and the Torah will nail you down because it is the Antichrist. Right? They openly denounce Jews who believe in Jesus, the Messianic Jews. Lots of, be a lot more of these bastards are out of the way. So that's, that's uh, Actually, I won't be weeping over you. What would you do? Absolutely not. I, 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 um, I've done with my weeping. I've shed so many tears over the years. And, uh, I was thinking the other day about that, uh, Every tear will be wiped away, they're mine. I remember the day that uh, America invaded Iraq, the 3rd of the 3rd, 2003. I'd shed m many, many tears way before this, but this day. This was the day when the uh, Western nations, the Antichrist, Benny Yin, and all of his ill. I, I know he's a Jew, but you know, you, you, you've, you've got America following this demon and all the others out there. You should have seen the lineup on the service. I, I was, uh, wanted to go back and find the, the video of it it's before YouTube days, but there's probably a video up there by now. I remember the day. I remember it because the day before, 
was a um, full-page photograph of a woman in Iraq, a mother. And of course all the news and the rumours that America was going to invade and, and bomb Baghdad. Why? On the pretext of Al-Qaeda. Where did that come from? The bullshit, lies, deception, the story that was spun. Amazing. Thank you Mossad, working with the American government, Bush Jr. It was all set up. So, on the pretext of hunting down Al-Qaeda, he was already dead for God's sake. Bin Laden. Bin Laden. Uh, Al-Qaeda was made up by the CIA. It's yeah, I, I, I know, you know, well, the, well, the world knows that. And I might add that you were the first one in the world to upload 16 pages onto the internet the same day from Australia you uploaded the most likely scenario who was behind the coming down of their towers and how they would do it. So that's what the Christ does. He plans to see the man to pick it up. But getting back to the invasion of Iraq, because this is why my tirade, actually it was my angel who took over whatever day it was, Sunday, when I launched and condemned America. I had no intention of doing that. And then it just took over. When I rewatched the uh, video, it was, ev it was very evident with my angel. All right, 3rd of the 3rd, 2003. K.R. Martin Chilliwack, God forsaken place in Canada, filled with Jesus loving Christians. John Witness? Uh, anyway, out there this day, and uh, the one who thought she was Mary had uh, taped. Benny Hinn and the International Day of Prayer, praying for America and the victory in Iraq. And I remembered the photograph I had looked at the day before in the Vancouver Sun front page Sunday newspaper. This mother in Iraq, tears streaming down her face, and the camera angle just, just, just below her like this, looking up, and the tears, and she's looking up toward heaven. She's crying and she's calling out for mercy from God. So here it is. I'm watching the replay of these demons that have been educating America, the Christian nation. Yeah, right. And it starts. They start praying victory for America, a quick victory in America. And I was sick. I wanted to throw up right then and I began wailing because I realised that day that America was going to be destroyed. I was on the floor and I called out where is the humility of the church in America? Where is their sackcloth and ashes? When I realised that America was going to be the nation that would be destroyed, the arrogance. America had the chance to be the greatest nation of all time and its pastors, preachers, teachers, ministers, evangelists have led you all up a garden path preaching the gospel of the snake, Judaism. The Jews have controlled your nation for a very, very long time. And the churches have swallowed it, hook, line and sinker. So I mourned for America on that day when I realised America was the devil. All backed up by the Jesus loving, Jesus worshipping Christians supporting Israel. Israel are the tribes. They're scattered. 
was never about the lump of dirt that is and will remain Palestine. In fact, they are the holy people. It's the Palestinians and the Syrians. That's why they've been picked on by the Jews who call themselves Jews and are not. And the delusion that has covered the earth. Gross darkness covers the earth. The lies <coughs> of the Antichrist. Western Christian churches to devour all of you. So, I've mourned. So how do you destroy America? Free energy. Come right. <laughs> Free energy. <laughs> One or two three pound balls. These here are all neodymium magnets. These are coils up top. So these here are coils. Be a coil down here, coil down here. And you can keep these locked up in here, ten of them if you like, until you need them and then you fire them around and to line up with that and then they'll run down to there, break away and replace the one that's been fired. So you've got eight or nine up there. When you want to speed it up, you fire two in, in sequence to line up with those. So the, now you've got six pounds dropping. When you want more, put more in. Now you've got Nine pounds dropping. Twelve. How much is number three? Fifteen. Steel ball. So you generate electricity. You generate a huge amount of power. You put a, a two-inch shark in there and drive a hundred uh, machines in a factory by belt. You don't have to have... Um, all the fancy stuff. So yes, if the world isn't dependent upon America for anything, America is destroyed, right? Eh? If the world is not dependent upon America for anything... There's another gear going on there, sir. You've got to be careful with uh, what I've got there by the way. That's inside a tube, a steel tube. So as it's dropping down, that's rolling because it's now drawn very tightly against that and it rolls down here. Then it gets to here, it's got to be broken away. Then you have these electromagnets here that can fire as many of these up but it's in sequence to hit one of these each time it comes around. So you can have, that can be way up the top here, wrap it right around, right around to here. And uh, we just keep on increasing the power and the speed. But it's completely variable. But don't worry about going backwards. You can always put a fucking gearbox in. Mm -hmm.